Hi Sagittarius, this is your next 7 days reading. I am going to look at your energies in this time period. The full moon uh, in Sagittarius is occurring uh, on, uh, it's occurring today. Uh, but you will be seeing this reading by tomorrow. That is 24th of May to 24th of May to uh, 20, uh, 31st of May. This reading is for that period. So full moon will affect your energies. A new uh, feeling will come to you with the Ace of Wands and Ace of Cups. So basically you are going to feel better in this time period. You can feel uh, the energy of self-love for yourself or you will be concentrating on yourself. You will be putting your mind on deep thinking in this time period. Inner turmoil could be happening. Uh, with the Ace of Wands, a, an innovative energy is also coming in in your life. So the influences of innovation, influences of finding the new goal, the new path, going towards the unknown. Uh, why? And it, it's happening because the uh, wheel of fortune, the destined cycle is changing. It's changing and you are going to write that and move towards innovation in life. So innovation in life means going towards new, a new motivation comes to you. Uh, in which you get enthusiasm as well to find new paths in your life. To find, uh, suppose there is a thing going on in your life, you will find a different way to deal with it. So the method will become different in this time period. So method of living your life, method of loving, method of studies or job is changing because you are going to redesign uh, your mental map in this time period by thinking deeply and you are going to move forward towards a new situation of being more structured. That is what I am seeing. Uh, so with the uh, uh, King of Cups energy, you could be dealing with a uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio or you could be dealing with uh, this energy of emotional intelligence. You will be more intelligent in this time period, a deep thinker, a person who takes care of themselves and takes care of others around them, trying to see things with uh, a perspective of love in this time period so you will be uh, having many options or many fronts will be open in front of you you would you would be doing um, trying to move and do many things at the same time in this time period but angels are asking you to think and do take your next steps uh, with the um, with the strength card and the hermit card you need your power your strength and your introspective energy in this time period. So you will be, uh, you know, uh, withdrawing or you will be trying to keep to yourself to become stronger or you need to do that in this time period because many fronts are open for you and you are moving from one job to the other and trying to finish everything in this time period. So a lot of things are happening and you are trying to control many things. Uh, in your mind, you are going through a passionate new spiritual energy which is coming in with the Ace of Wands. It's a very good card. It gives you, uh, you know, um, new methods to do things, to see things differently. It brings in passion in your life. It makes you look at your lover with a new interest. Um, and it gives you that uh, fiery uh, you know start it gives you that initial spark which is required and ace of cups is also giving you a great sensation feeling new love or new uh, you know look new look uh, at your own life so um, with the empress and the king of pentacles energy you could be dealing with a mother figure you could be dealing with a father figure mother figure uh, you could be looking for uh, 
uh, stability you could be attracting uh, you know help from these people taurus or go capricorn or a libra or a taurus uh, you have gone through a setback very recently and uh, it can be a setback in love it can be a setback or betrayal uh, uh, or you know you have felt that you have get gotten into a situation which is full of uh, you know problems or losses some kind of loss you feel that loss so in this time period with your power and with your introspection and with your new energy uh, and choices you are moving towards the world uh, so in this time period in this week uh, you will be finishing a saturnian cycle so um, or this will carry on for some time this you know winding up of old patterns old methods and starting of new things is going to start uh, in your life so there is going to be an upgrade in your life definitely you could be uh, underlying energy is strict energies around you with the king of swords and the king of uh, queen of swords they could be um, you a couple around you could be parents uh, could be uh, you know some kind of colleagues uh, similar type of man and a woman uh, partner who could be affecting you they were interfering in your life or they are giving you uh, realistic advice or intellectual advice uh, so you could be listening to them and uh, you are going through a sense of change in this time period and you are introspecting so internally uh, you could be uh, moving into a new cycle uh, with your change of perception or change of your physical direction in this time period because there is the page of wands this will be a new change enthusiasm coming to you with the high priestess it is also your inner soul is knocking at you in this time period your intuitive guidance is also uh, of change it is asking you to move towards new beginnings in some sort or the other uh, so what's coming to you is the justice and the magic energy magician energy so fairness will be found karma justice will come to you whatever you deserve you will get that if you have done a good job if you have done good karma you will get good karma and most of you will get good karma uh, because the magical energy of the magician is going to make some dreams of yours fructify so miraculously you will reach good results in your love in your job in your family matters so intuitive guidance downloads are coming to you and uh, you could be successful or you could be reaching a balance in your life in this time period with new energies that are creeping into your life and you will be very wise and very strong so in terms of health you will be strong in terms of family you will be doing well in terms of love you will be doing well and with the uh, you know cosmic guidance and your introspection you are going to have the power to sail through uh, the losses that you have gone uh, gone through and by the end of this week you will be a changed person and methods will be changing in your life you will be initiating new action and uh, the energy of mercury energy of uh, you know venus energy of jupiter everything will be affecting your uh, you know uh, seventh house so seventh house is relationship partnership uh, and these planets are coming into uh, the um, uh, house of gemini that is your seventh house sagittarius so that is the house of relationship things will be becoming better in terms of your relationship whether you are dealing with the strict people rude people or very very uh, you know factual people around you uh, so uh, the problem the only problem here is that uh, that you could be uh, making wrong judgments about people in this time period or your judgment might be flawed or you are not judging yourself carefully or seeing 
what level or uh, what changes you need to do in your own life so uh, it is creeping it uh, uh, very very slowly but it will be coming in for you so that you do not face losses see sagittarius is the most lucky sign and uh, if you do hard work if you uh, set a routine or if you set uh, your boundaries with your person if you do not feel mm, for uh, the one more thing i want to tell you is king of swords and king of uh, queen of swords uh, can also mean that some of you in your love life have lost that passion uh, for your lover or your uh, you know partner and you are too uh, direct with them and that is causing unpleasantness between you and them so it might not be third party it might not it might be that you are also becoming uh, you know too strict or non emotional regarding uh, relationships but what will happen by the end of with the moon full moon uh, with the entry of jupiter and venus in your 7th house things will be start becoming better you will be manifesting a uh, great uh, you know situation karmic situation for yourself maybe a new karmic relationship will start for you formally you will be ending one and starting a new situation some of you will be recognizing your own worth in this time period so uh, uh, the, your energies are going to change in this time period uh, definitely towards your betterment so let's read out uh, the star code uh, astro card for you so the card of saturn is coming for you which tells us that uh, that structure is important so saturn rules that which we must build over time our bones our teeth our personal authority maturity borders discipline traditions and organization so this is uh, you know sagittarius saturn is right now in your um, fourth house placed in your fourth house and it is also ruler of your um, third house that is the house of aquarius so uh, fourth house is your uh, your house of pisces uh this house the, your soul house is going to get structured in this time period internally you are going to find a structure in your thoughts so um saturn like jupiter is is uh, a, a huge planet and it impacts us so action action when saturn is influencing us action is uh, that uh, it asks you to step into the next level of maturity so it is asking you all of you sagittarius will be stepping into next level of maturity and personal authority so think of saturn as a martial art master who pushes you to grow through workouts practice discipline and uh, you know tests that allow you to prove what you know so both yourself and others so it is also vis-a-vis -vis others so look for a mentor or choose a mentor uh, for yourself honor the teacher uh, but don't give your power away listen to the uh, experts um, mix their wisdom and your experience and make your own wise decisions so you will be having your wisdom in this time period you will be showing your courage as well with the strength card so strength and hermit uh, is your own power and the king of swords and queen of swords could be your mentors or people around you or your parents who are giving you uh, this uh, advice who are intellectually guiding you so it is exactly your cards are falling in place so maybe some of you are going through you know advice sessions from your friend regarding your love life but do not take everything uh, uh, you know and try to uh, you know cultivate that you need to have your own mind in this time period and structure your mind according to your wishes so uh, basically you will 
require your own wisdom your experience and make your own wise decisions if you feel like someone is abusing their authority or undermining yours or you need to set firm boundaries and hold them accountable uh, study cope and grow up so look pragmatically at the the structure the uh, maybe the body bone structure maybe the structure of your job maybe the routine of your job maybe the uh, love and the core of the relationship that is what is important so gain strength in your mind and muscle and bone and you can become uh, uh, you know uh, if you gain too much then what will happen is you can become stiff uh, but to uh, you have to remember to be flexible and stretch your body and soul so be careful not to cling to old conceptions um, or success or past glory uh, because it will restrict your potential and leave other people discouraged so the best thing about this uh, planet is that the ancestors are calling you for wisdom and maturity to know your gifts and limitations this process may be an initiation a test that empowers you so basically this is uh, you know a bit preachy but let me tell you this is what is happening in your life whether you are an accomplished person or whether you are a student or whether you are a new lover or an old lover what you need to do in this time period is to uh, listen to others but draw upon your own uh, you know inner wisdom uh, and your body strength uh, if you are doing something physical uh, all your manifestations will come true what you deserve will come to you make your correct judgment in this time period and you will be initiating a new life situation in your life because the wheel of fortune is changing and destined maturity is coming in in all sagittarius so if you have liked this reading please like and subscribe if you want to uh, say something you can write in the comment box people who want a personal reading can contact me through the uh, email id in the description box you can also uh, you know explore membership options if you want that uh, you can uh, uh, you know uh, say super thanks it is just the icon is just below this video you keep uh, you know sharing my readings that is important to your friends and fam family family members you can uh, also subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed so keep watching thank you so much bye bye